good afternoon ladies and gentlemen fan be with you and welcome welcome to car mechanic 2015 hey it's great to have your company thank you so much for dropping by now i thought we'd get into car mechanic at 2015 as we haven't been in here for quite some time and uh, i don't know whether you those who have been following the channel and following the series in in uh, 2015 the object or what i was endeavoring to do is to actually have every car represented uh, in our parking garage and as you can see we've uh, gone through quite a number of cars uh, restored them all up these, these are full restoration uh, cars of course are purchased from the auction brought back into the garage and done full restorations on um, just did, went through those off camera and the only one I could find was actually the main M8 now if you can see any cars that I haven't got listed there you may want to pause the uh, the video right now and just have a look if you can tell me there any other cars that I'm, I'm missing by all means let me know because as I said I'm just endeavoring to get every car represented here in the parking garage why uh, because we can but uh, as I said it is the uh, the uh, Mayan M8 that uh, that I haven't had I haven't got represented here and I uh, just went off off camera I uh, went to the auction and purchased one uh, parts and conditions 69% body condition 49% a car value of uh, 37,300 as you can see there now because we haven't actually we'll do this very very quickly because we haven't been in 2015 for quite some time i think i actually yes i have got quite a lot of parts in the inventory so i might even just take a moment to clear out that inventory <clears throat> excuse me and um see what we end up cash wise so we start with uh 224,425 Now, as you see, after selling all those parts that we had laying around in the inventory, I mean, some of them we're about to use a bit later, perhaps, but there's a lot of uh, stuff that we're not going to use again. Uh, if we do need it, we'll obviously just purchase it again. So we started off with 224,000. Now we've got 277,000 and change, which well, that equates to about $53,000 worth of parts laying around in the inventory. And, and that 53,000 obviously can be used in in better areas so that's why i thought i'd get rid of all that uh those spare parts laying around in the inventory so let's pop it on the oh uh, we'll, we should went on this other one just just because it's closer to the uh to the repair table and we're going to need him uh, a little bit later so let's go from the left lifter to the right lifter and what we can do is let's repair the body uh, over at our world if it uh, needs yes it does need repair for sixteen hundred dollars lovely and uh, yeah, let's get into it. Take these body parts off and uh, let's make some money. Left headlight for 100 bucks. Okay, so that actually should complete every, all the body work there. Let's have a look at that body condition 100%, exactly what we're after. So uh, now we've done the body. Uh, as you can see, I did actually run it through the test path, uh, not the test path, the um, the dyno before I come on camera. 300 horsepower, um, as is, as it comes out of the uh, as it come out of the auction, uh, and we'll see what that increases to, if in fact it does increase, when we uh, when we fix him up. Uh, let's dive into it and get some of these parts off.
Okay, so that's all the parts out of the uh, the vehicle, and we should have a parts condition condition of zero percent. In fact, we do because obviously all the parts are, are missing. Uh, we go over to the repair table and see how many of those parts we can repair up, and obviously uh, the ones that we can't repair, we'll just simply go and buy a brand new parts. So. Okay, so that in fact should be all the parts uh, repaired to up to 100% and those that couldn't be repaired uh, We just went ahead and bought brand new parts. So here comes the fun bit of getting all the bits back into the uh, the Motor so you see how we go there. Hopefully we don't end up with too many spare parts at the end As uh, like all things that you need to put back together you tend to end up with spare bolts or, or nuts at the end and uh, I don't know about you, but I tend to just call those spares. The machine runs afterwards and, and after you put it back together and it runs, well, that's good enough for me. So let's get all these parts back in and um, yeah, see what sort of profit margin we make when we get to the end. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are getting very, very close to completing this full restoration of the uh, main M8 and just getting this oil pan on the bottom there. And of course, once the oil pan's on, we're able to uh, bring him back down off the lifter and uh, put some oil in the old girl. And then we're able to uh, actually, we won't even run it through the dyno afterwards. We, we did actually run it through the, uh, the dyno before we made a start on the, uh, the restoration. And. Um, I'll have to look before uh, before we actually do that what sort of horsepower it was pulling to be honest. So I think it's something like 300 horsepower off the top of my head. But um, yeah, we'll see. We did have a couple of um, performance parts we popped in there. Uh, we didn't actually go for full performance parts this time. Uh, that's what we're looking for. Parts condition 100%, body condition 100%. Uh, there we are, 300 horsepower prior to the full restoration. Let's pop them in the dyno and see what it's pulling now. Now that's interesting, just with those couple of performance parts and with in fact uh, the rest of the parts uh, brand new. Another 18 horsepower, now I'm not going to go through and, and, and tune it. Just for this, keeping this this video a little bit uh, a little bit shorter, but uh, there we have it. I full restored uh, main M8, and it's all its splendor. Let's see what the old girl is worth. If I can remember to press the right button, there we go. Uh, car value uh, eighty-two thousand six hundred and seventy-four, and that'll st simply go in our garage to uh, in our parking garage to uh, complete our collection. All right, guys, thank you very much for your company. Certainly do appreciate it. If there's any cars that you think that I should be doing that, I, that I've missed, as I said, to complete the collection in our parking garage, by all means, let me know in the comments section. Uh, with that, thank you very much for your company. Certainly do appreciate it, and I'll look forward to it in the next one.